The president's budget proposal eliminates public media funding. Learn how you can help at lptv.org slash action. So the Roseau girls basketball season comes to a close, but this season and Williams Arena are two things the team will never forget. As time ticked down on the Roseau girls basketball team's season, senior guard Kylie Borovich wasn't even watching. She was holding younger sister Casey with tears streaming down her face. Just like the whole season, I knew I had, I had one season left with, all, with both of them together. Our journey since third grade is over. The journey may have come to an end, but it had the perfect ending. An undefeated 32-0 season and the first girls basketball state title in team history. For us just to be the team that like everyone's going to remember means a lot. We worked so hard. We, um, Like I said again, elementary through high school, we've been playing together, all of us, even Casey, every summer in all these tournaments. <laughs> All the weekends in the spring, all the weekends in the winter, and for us to like pull through in our senior year and win the state title by more than 10, it means a lot, especially like we know the whole town's rooting for us back home, even hockey boys. <laughs> and although they all admit Roseau is still a hockey town, for a day the city bled Ram Green as girls basketball reigned queen. Just really excited to bring this back to Rozo and just um, the excitement and enthusiasm from the whole community. Um, and, and I think for them, it, it, it's different than a state hockey title. You know, this has kind of been a fun learning experience and something different for them. And I think the community has just really embraced it. And it's, um, it's going to be awesome to see um, the community reception. Guards Casey and Kylie Barovich, along with forward Victoria Johnson, were named to the Class 2A All-Tournament team. And a pretty cool moment earlier this evening as the state champion Rose Oak girls basketball team was officially welcomed home. As you see here, fans packed the Rose Oak High School Gymnasium to welcome back the undefeated state champions earlier tonight. Special thanks to the voice of the Rams, Zach Swanson, for the pictures. A very cool moment there. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.